Hi, it's me again. I uh, just want to put together some really quick videos because I think doing short uh, little videos because it's the little things uh, when you put it all together uh, make for uh, big things to happen. In this video, I just want to talk about carrying the puck along the side. And this goes particularly for Berkeley, who likes to usually carry it out front out here all the time. Um, I think if we could uh, get you to carry it more to the side, uh, you'd be better off. The, the key to that, to that as well, is you know, you know, when you're standing up like this, and you, then you have your stick out, your lie is like that. But when you crouch down, then your your stick come will typically come up off, off the ice. This is your blade here. This is your stick. That's you. Uh, and so to compensate for that, what you do is you raise your uh, top hand arm and elbow up, and that way it keeps the, the blade flatter on the ice. And if you notice, the puck is you know, near the uh, uh, heel of the blade. The knees are somewhat met, uh, bent, and uh, you can see the positioning uh, of his hands on the stick. His top hand is working the stick and the bottom hand is really just more, should be more or less just a guide. If you remember uh, a year or so ago, I made some uh, PVC pipes, slipped it over your uh, sticks so you wouldn't be gripping hard here. This would, the stick would just slide through. The other thing on puck handling too is when you're receiving pass, if you get a hard pass, you may need to drop that glove hand clear down here so you got to bend. I see Connor does that uh, quite a bit. So uh, the, the takeaway here is kind of keep this thing, the stick off to the side, carry it that way versus straight out. And the other thing uh, by doing that, you're going to have greater range of the stick that you can swing to help uh, deke out your defenseman or even your goalie if you're holding your stick more like this versus like this where you, your, your range is only going to be in the chop, you're going to do the chop chop I call it or back side to side uh, much easier for the defenseman to um, to defend against and, and poke check the puck so you're going to get uh, greater puck control you're going to get uh, greater puck protection, greater range, and you'll be able to be more deceptive on your puck handling. So that's it for this one. Uh, catch you later.